I'm Eric Kehoe, team manager for the Honda Red Bull Racing Team. So tell us a little bit about the bikes this year. Obviously, they uh, they for sure look a lot trickier than they have been in the past with the hydraulic clutch and some other little goodies. Um, what's been going on behind the scenes? We've done quite a bit of testing this off season, uh, working on some uh, some things that we wanted to improve, uh, make the uh, riders a little more comfortable, improve performance. Uh, so we've got a few tricks uh, up our sleeve that we've come up with, and that hydraulic clutch uh, is one of them. And it seems to work out really good for the guys, and uh, we're real happy with it right now. So we're here with Davey Millsaps. You got one of the trickiest bikes in the pits. How does it feel? Oh, it's great. You know, it's good to be uh, good to be on the team again. It's uh, we've done a lot of work to the new 2010 bike, and uh, you know, it's <laughs> last year struggled, and this year we've done a lot. We've done a really like we took the bike and dissected it and figured out what we needed to do to it, and that's what we did. And you know, Han and I've been working really hard and to get this bike to where we needed to be, and and to fit my style and to fit my you know fit how I like it to ride and. Uh, that's what we did, you know, we changed, there's so many things on that thing, I can't even tell you what we changed. Yeah. It's, uh, it's uh, that's not what I'm, my job is to do, my job is just to ride it, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Carlos told us about all the changes and yeah. stuff, but it's got to be a mental booster to, to know that your bike is where you want it. And Yeah, I know, for sure, it gives you, it gives you that, that fight back that you know that you can do well, it gives you the eye of the tiger when you, when you have a good bike that you know that can do good and you can do good on so I'm pumped to, pumped to be riding that. Carlos Rivera, uh, range for Davey Millsap, number 18. So tell us a little bit about uh, Davey's bike this year. They seem like Honda's really kicked it up with the uh, getting as close to his works bike as you can have without having a uh, with having a production rule. No, definitely the, we make some improvement. Uh, he's going to have a different clutch set up which a lot of people uh, be curious about it and it looks really good, works, he likes it, so we're very excited, we're looking forward. Yeah, and there's a lot of buttons on the handlebars, can you talk about those? It's just a normal button, so we always have a stop button, the other thing is just a parachute button. Parachute. <laughs> <laughs> so. yeah. What's the biggest thing that a regular guy can learn from a factory mechanic? What, what would you want to tell the regular guy who wants to make their Honda 450 a little bit better? Well, first of all, you got to go buy a Honda from the dealership, and then uh, after that, you know, you can uh, uh, start working things, suspension. Uh, it's a 450, the engine is pretty strong stock bike, so, you know, I would recommend people just go and get the suspension dial in for the home, for the weight and stuff like that, and uh, uh, engine, leave the engine department for last, because there's plenty of power in the 450. But then it's like little things about the grip compound and maybe the levers and lever position. How important and critical is that for guys oh it definitely you know as you know and a lot of people know I've been working for Davies for over 10 years and uh, you learn things that particular things that they like it and it's just from lever setup uh, from seat cover foot pegs uh, shift levers everything I mean it's just they all prefer something and every try every time you try something they like it better so now you have to modify everything for his uh, it's, it's amazing. I mean, it's so many things in the bike that you don't realize, but it just fit to the rider. A lot, a lot different than just slapping a pipe on it and going, huh? That's correct, yes. <laughs> it's more than that. Eric, what can uh, the average guy learn about all the testing and stuff that you guys have done to get their bike all set up? I'd say the first thing that uh, people can do uh, when they're out at the local tracks it's just uh, experiment a little bit. You know, that's that's all we do in testing is uh, experiment with different settings. And if your uh, you know if your suspension's a little soft or a little bit bouncy or whatever it is, you know that you're feeling, you know, uh, change up the clickers a little bit. You know, slow slow the rebound down. Um, you know, stiffen up the suspension with the compression. You know, don't be afraid to change some settings and uh, experiment a little bit so you can uh, make yourself more comfortable on the bike and uh, maybe twist that throttle a little harder.